Let's take a quick gander. What's this last one have on it? That limit break damage could be useful. We'll probably wait another level then. Checking to make sure there's nothing to grab. Here to rescue Aerith, remember? We don't need more attention than what we're gonna get. We need to be smart. Yeah, I hear you. But my soul's screaming for payback, you know? I'm a ticking time bomb. And sooner or later, I'm gonna have to blow up. Well, then make it later. When did I get AP up? Tyria. Oh, that was what the one for walking is. Okay, where's this? Uh, someone to keep us. truck, isn't it? Come on. No. Uh.
How's it looking out there? Anything? Nah. All clear. Roger. Okay, head on in. <sighs> so far, so good. <laughs> <laughs> Where'd you come from? <laughs> Give it all you got. Always do. service entrance in the back. Barrett's level 30. <laughs> I wonder actually how uh, real quick look. 250 divided by 5. Well, 50 is what it looks like everything maxes out at. Good. Good sweat. Chest back here.
check and make sure there's nothing hidden. Move aside. <laughs> Jesus, that fight. Sure hope no one else knows we're here. Come on, we need to move. Nobody's home. Yeah. Do you have any idea where they might be holding Aerith? I'm thinking a research facility. That'd make the most sense. 
And where is that? Upper floors. Maybe near the top. That's where you are. <sighs> Maybe. Maybe we can use the console at the reception desk to find out. This building's incredible. <laughs> a shiny monument to the corporate group. One of these days, I'm going to tear it down and burn the rubble. But not today. Yeah, yeah. I don't think we should try touching it. Shit, making life hard. Let's just keep heading up. So, how do we get upstairs? Either the elevator or the emergency stairwell. Isn't the lab we're looking for on one of the top floors? I vote we take the stairs because it's safer. Exhibition hall, elevator hall, emergency exit. Key card report. required. Key card required. No getting upstairs without a key card, huh? I think we're gonna need a few before this is over. Pretty sure I saw one lying around. Oh, the reception desk. Yeah, but how to get in. Go up and over, maybe? Look. Pretty sure we could reach it if we hop across those lights. I don't know. I think I'll give it a shot. Huh? As the lightest one here, I figure I've got the best chance. You two can sit back and watch. No. <sighs> Okay, guys. Wish me luck. You be careful. Aren't I always? <laughs> this is slow as balls. Wait, I wish they would have done this just through the cutscene. Take a look around. Because stuff like that's always hidden.
This isn't so bad. Don't Pretty close now. Jinx it. Just need to make it over there. Almost there. Just need to get across those platforms. That's some fine work. Uh, I might be able to disable security from here. Huh? Ha! Hot damn, girl. But I didn't do anything. Shit, I'll take it. So you can use that to look up what floor the research facility's on? I think so. Give me a sec. Huh. Bingo. Professor Hojo's lab. 65th floor looks like. Huh. Guess we can only get to the 59th floor via the elevators or stairs. To access any level above that, we need to check in at the Skyview Hall reception. 59th floor it is there. Mm -hmm. Right. I'll take the escalator. That might be road driven. <laughs> the motorcycle may be driven on later. And I'm taking stairs. I always take stairs though. You have got to be shitting me. Nope. We're a lot less likely to get caught this way. But a lot more likely to die of boredom. <laughs> it's only 59 floors. Nothing to it. Well, at least it ain't a race. Small blessing. Please tell me he gets tired on the way up like he did in uh, the original. security and restrictions it's not gonna get any easier we're gonna be exhausted i'm not get dizzy doing this to get to the top. as long as you pace yourself you'll be fine maybe we should take a quick break come on barry you can stop if you want you can even say it's for me just say you can't hack it i'll hack you jackass there's oh, tifa running ahead of us arguments aren't gonna get us there faster but Tifa I wasn't not now save it for the top I love that I get fatigued <laughs> oh 59 floors 
It's even worse than the original, actually. Guess these labs and shit are all the way at the very top. Yep, the very top. That's good to know. We're a third of the way there. Cloud, keep an eye on Barrett. Copy. What was that? I don't think I heard you. Speak up. I'll keep an eye on Barrett. <laughs> Thanks for the assist. <laughs> Whatever. Just gonna give him a second to catch up. <laughs> Tifa's a good five floors above us. We're halfway there, though, now. We're halfway there now. Okay. Hey, I can't talk. Just a few floors behind you. <laughs> Hey Silver, how are you doing? Hard to argue with that. Let's go. I mean, he's not Star Fox. We're part of the Star Fox team, so we can't have metal legs. I could have enjoyed Persona 5 the first time, and I didn't want to do another, what was probably then now going to be another 10 hours on top of the 100 hours it took to beat the first time. Worst route ever. Give me a suicidal last day. At least, at least, at least that had happened in. <laughs> Let's shut up. Yes, let's. Wow. Silver, did you take stairs or did you do elevator? I assume stairs as well. Because wishing for trouble might bring it. Yep. You're in no state to fight anyway. So, what should I do? Shut up and move. Seven more stairs. <laughs> I love the clouds just like tired out now. <laughs> Bear, it's like a zombie. I 
want to go back. <laughs> I can't believe they actually designed all this out. This is so awesome. <laughs> Stopped, Barrett. Seventy, eighty, ninety, one hundred percent, one hundred ten. Mako supersaturation confirmed. <laughs> Engaging materia cooling to reduce temperature. Director, you have a meeting shortly. Stop. Your timing is impeccably atrocious. Uh, uh. <laughs> Mako density and materia integrity are both holding steady. Registering mass increase in core materia. That can't be good. Contaminants registered. We're leaving. Materia growth accelerating, outpacing models. Registering crystallization within the reserve tank. The reaction is out of control. We have to stop it quickly. Clean up the mess, would you? Ma'am. <laughs> so this is still. the Skyview Hall, huh? Bet this place cost a fortune and then some. Let's look for reception. Okay, there's the elevators. Reception up there. Let's go through here first, though. Hey, check it out. Come take a look, Cloud. Never stopping to think how it'll end for them. <laughs> yeah. Terrible, but beautiful all the same.
Valhalla reception. You must be here for our grand tour. Visitors have access to floors 60, 61, 62, as well as floor 63. You will proceed in that order. By the exit of each floor, you will find a device that will allow you to update the key card in your possession, thereby allowing you to access the next floor. And now begins your grand tour. Please enjoy the Shinra experience. Why has this whole thing got to be such a big pain in the ass? I don't know about you, but this is kind of weird. You think everything's going too well? Yeah, I do. Think this is a trap? Ha! <laughs> if it is, then bring it on. Let's get this party started. God damn it, Barrett. Man, why we gotta get all these damn key cards just to get anywhere? This is Shinra HQ. The how did you expect? Says the former company man himself. Guess you'd know about all the rules, regulations, and red tape. It's like coming home, huh? Is there elevators? It looks like it's on the next floor that we need. Yes, every reactor, every pillar. Like I said, a full inspection. There's no telling what kind of damage there might be. If you see anything, anything out of the ordinary, I want to know. Sorry to bother you, sir. No, it's fine. I brought the damage assessment for Sector 7 you requested. Sir, perhaps you should try and get some sleep. No, not yet. I need to finish preparing my draft of the reconstruction plan before tonight's board meeting. <sighs> Whatever reasons they might have had, destroying an entire sector is... It's beyond the pale. Director, I would strongly advise you not to say such things outside of this room. <sighs> Don't I know it. Okay, so can't keep going up, but I guess check out the museum. Let's see if there's any Easter eggs in that picture. But I can spot quickly at least. Shinra and our esteemed president? 
and to get a peek at the president's mementos? That was super cool! All the different divisions. Palmer. <laughs> now, moving along. The next exhibit will teach you about the important work we do here by giving you a closer look at each of our divisions. I hope you're ready to be amazed because you simply won't believe all the exciting adventures we have here. These all look so familiar. Because we've destroyed a bunch of them already. The advanced weaponry exhibit is currently undergoing maintenance. We apologize for the inconvenience. What? What? Uh, read this? This paper right here? Uh, give me a moment. Welcome to the Shinra building. The Space and Aeronautics Division has taken rocket systems developed for military applications and adapted them to a different purpose. The search for new precious resources in the infinite reaches of space. That being said, since we have plenty of Mako at the present, those plans are currently on hold. It's a bit of a shame, really. My duties as Director of Research and Development are, in all likelihood, far beyond your ability to comprehend. So there will be no presentation, as it would be a waste of my time and yours. But rest assured, we are making great strides. Albeit not at this particular moment, because I'm filming this rubbish instead. I believe I've wasted enough of my precious time as it is. Science waits for no one. Good day. Flippin Hojo. Heidegger. The public security exhibit is currently undergoing maintenance. We apologize for the inconvenience. So just Reeve left? Oh, that's actually kind of like a utopia looking thing there. Welcome to the Shinra building. Our mission here at Urban Planning is to supply the residents of Midgar with energy created from Mako. We also take pride in maintaining public infrastructure, the pillars and railways that run all throughout the city. Currently, we are working to construct an intraplate expressway. When this project has been completed, it will provide much easier access to numerous locations all across Midgar. We appreciate your patience and understanding in the meantime. I mean, seriously, that actually looks like what you would think a futuristic city would look like. <laughs> Moving along, 
The next exhibit will teach you all about the miracle of Mako energy and our reactors, as well as the city of Midgar itself. So come on! This uh, is this Midgar, room. our home, recreated in one ten thousandth scale. As you can see here, the eight Mako reactors form a ring around the center of our city and keep Midgar running day and night. The Mako which flows beneath our feet is a truly limitless resource. At Shinra, we have developed technologies to extract it and transform it into the fuel and electricity that powers everything we do. Thanks to the miracle of Mako energy, our lives are richer and better than ever before. Mako keeps our lights on at night and made Midgar into the city that never sleeps. A triumph of technology and testament to man's potential. Nothing but a bunch of lies. Except that Mako has made people's lives better. It's made people blind. Blind to the cold hard truth. Even I used to buy into their bullshit. Remembering that makes me even madder. Congratulations! You can call yourself a proud Shinra scholar! Now, moving along. Next, you'll learn about our progress in advanced science and technology. Please proceed to the 61st floor, the Visual Entertainment Hall. Welcome to the Visual Entertainment Hall, where we showcase Shinra's cutting-edge technology. Through an immersive visual and audio experience, please relax and enjoy the show. Going <laughs> into a theater? This place is empty. What the hell? distant past, our planet was home to a people we call the Ancients. Many millennia before we discovered Mako, these precursors were already pioneering its use. Somehow they learned of the great reservoir of energy pulsing beneath their feet. And once they had the ancients developed the means to harness this bountiful energy and bend it to their will. The fruits of their labors have survived to this very day in the form of certain kinds of materia. Their scripture, too, has endured. We who are born of the planet, with her we speak, her flesh we shape. Unto her promised land, shall we one day return. By her loving grace and providence, may we take our place in paradise. Alas, the ancients themselves are long gone. 2,000 years ago, a meteor brought an end to their civilization. <laughs> but before their fiery end, did the ancients find their promised land? Even now, we have only to wonder. Times have changed, and the Shinra Electric Power Company is committed to changing and evolving with them. Like the ancients, we have harnessed the power of Mako. Are they out there watching us, waiting for us to join them in some blessed corner of the world? A green inverted land where boundless Mako energy will provide for our every need. Shinra is working for you to fulfill the hope of the ancients and lead us to that promised land.
We shall not rest until our dream is realized. Oh dear, a man of my refined taste running out of butter. <laughs> Short of its proper accompaniment, this tea might as well be boiled pond water. <laughs> thing made me want to puke and not just because of the presentation but the content too ought to come with a warning that ain't for kids that wasn't just a movie that huge meteor what was that about like i said nothing you should show a kid okay 